Hey guys, welcome to a hurricane vlog. This is Hurricane Ian vlog number one. Uh, I've been doing these hurricane vlogs for a while now. I forget what the first hurricane I did one for. It might have been Hurricane Matthew, but um, it's always a fun way to update friends and family, but also a, a good thing to post to the channel. A lot of people seem to enjoy it. So Hurricane Ian's gonna hit us soon, and I figured I would vlog that. Um, since the last hurricane vlog I did a few years ago, I have a newer GoPro now, so the video will look better. You know, once it starts raining, but before the storm really hits, I always like to go outside, um, shoot something in the rain with the GoPro, just so people can see uh, what it looks like to be there. And uh, with, yeah, this GoPro will allow me to do it a little bit better than before. Um, it handles the lighting and colors a bit better. So Hurricane Ian, I'm looking at it right now on my phone with uh, windy.com. It's one of my favorite websites. I've been using it forever, and they just recently added a hurricane tracker. Um, it currently has passed Cuba, and it is heading towards uh, Cape Coral, it looks like, Tampa. It's coming in from the west coast, and then it's going to cross over to the east coast of Florida. Right now it's expected to go up to like Georgia, South Carolina. Um, it looks like both models that are on um, windy.com show that it's you know show about the same thing and they both seem to suggest that it's going to hit us thursday ish um that date's pretty subject to change i mean right up until the hurricane hits they're always updating the predictions um so you know we'll see how that changes and i'll keep posting vlogs i usually do them once a day um try not to do too much more than that because it gets gets old but i like to keep everybody updated uh we are going to start bringing stuff in soon you know during the hurricane pretty much anything that's loose can be picked up even in like tropical storm force winds which it's looks like by the time it hits us it will be a tropical storm uh at worst a category one but uh things you know things can be picked up um here let me turn the camera around stuff like this log or uh those pots over there uh, these sticks, <laughs> if they don't pick these up soon, we're gonna have to bring these inside because that's definitely dangerous. The storm can just pick those up and throw them through houses and at cars and stuff. So everything needs to be brought in that could be potentially lifted up by the storm. Uh, we're hoping, we just had to replace our roof after Irma and then Irma also took down our fence that we, uh, we had replaced that like two years ago. It took us a while to get that done. So we're hoping we don't have any damage to either of those things because, uh, you know, we fixed those in the past couple years. So that would, that would kind of suck, but we'll see what happens. Um, and yeah, I'll continue to update you guys. I think that's really all I have right now. We're just, you know, playing it safe, not panicking. And uh, I'm not super duper worried. Just, you know, a little cautious, obviously. It's a hurricane, but yeah. I'll keep you guys posted. Oh, real quick. We are starting to get some storm clouds. These are clouds from the storm, um, which is why I called them storm clouds. And uh, right now, I mean, it's kind of harder to tell, but they are different. They're different than like what normal clouds look like here, especially like around this time of day. They're a lot choppier. I don't, I'm not a meteorologist, so I don't really know the proper terminology, but they're a lot choppier, a lot more broken up, and we're covering like this almost wintry gray sky, you know? There's no, you can't see through it to the sky. There's the sun right there in the center that you can barely see. And it gives everything like this nice, even lighting. Uh, no harsh shadows or anything. Yeah, you can see over there, just, it's kind of broken up. I think it's different layers, you know? You have like a thin, like solid layer above and then like a little bit lower you have these broken up layers uh, it makes some really cool cloud formations though so and uh yeah the uh the only other thing i can think to say right now is the stores are uh definitely out of stuff the governor declared a state of emergency a few days ago so people have been panic buying uh you know i've had friends sent, tell me, we, we got our stuff pretty early, just like a couple cases of water. Um, and I've had friends tell me they've gone a lot later and with a lot less success. Um, but yeah, that's all I have for today's vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll keep you posted. 
See you soon. Bye.